Imagine hopping into a car that is able to drift on its own. The cars featured in this video are able to perform things we once didn't think possible. And one of these is to execute insane drift tricks. And all of that without needing a professional driver. In fact, none at all. But how can they perform such precise maneuvers? And why even need this ability in the first place? Let's start by exploring the vehicles capable of this insane drifting and the companies behind them. Marty, a 1981 DeLorean, was once thought to be a relic of automotive history. Not anymore. At least, not once Stanford University was done with it. Transformed by Stanford's Dynamic Design Lab into an all-electric, autonomous drift car, Marty has revolutionized the concept of self-driving with its ability to execute high-precision drifts. This capability was showcased during an amazing demonstration at Thunder Hill Raceway in Northern California where Marty flawlessly navigated a complex obstacle course. The transformation of this iconic car into an autonomous drifter was led by John Goh, who is a PhD graduate in mechanical engineering at Stanford. The project, known as Marty Kana, is derived from the Jim Kana autocross racing format, which tests a driver's precision and control. Traditional autonomous vehicles are designed for simple tasks like lane keeping or cruise control, but Marty is different. It is engineered to handle high-speed, complex driving scenarios. This includes the ability to drift through courses with exceptional agility and accuracy, relying solely on GPS coordinates and advanced algorithms. And it looks really cool doing so. The innovations developed through Marty have significant implications for the future of autonomous driving. The data collected from Marty's runs provide invaluable insights into vehicle dynamics under extreme conditions. This research helps refine the algorithms that could one day enable consumer vehicles to perform emergency maneuvers with the precision and confidence of a professional driver. By pushing the boundaries of what autonomous cars can do, Marty helps to expand the operational envelope of these technologies, ensuring they can react competently in unpredictable situations. Through rigorous testing and continuous improvement, the project shows how advanced AI can effectively mimic and even surpass human driving skills under hazardous conditions. But the development of such capabilities didn't stop there. Another, much larger player would soon enter the scene of AI drifting. A similar project to Marty is spearheaded by a large-scale car manufacturer familiar to all of us, Toyota. For this, Toyota's Research Institute also collaborated with Stanford University's Dynamic Design Lab. Toyota is focusing on extreme maneuvering capabilities. This new technology is centered around enabling ordinary vehicles to temporarily emulate the advanced skills of expert drivers. Their work began with adapting a specially prepared Toyota Supra to handle autonomous drifting. The technology involves control of the vehicle's steering, throttle, clutch displacement, and brakes. It's basically a Formula Drift race car. This Supra is equipped with enhanced suspension, engine, transmission, and safety equipment, and has an impressive ability to autonomously navigate through sharp corners and around obstacles on a closed course. The vehicle's computer systems calculate a new trajectory every 20th of a second allowing it to maintain a graceful balance and precise control. It can do this even while performing aggressive maneuvers that are typically hard to manage manually. The practical testing of this technology again took place at Thunder Hill Raceway in California on a closed two-mile track specifically designed with defined obstacles. While it's unlikely that the next Toyota Camry will come equipped with an auto drift feature, Toyota's research into autonomous drifting is certainly exciting. Do you think you could drift a car better than AI? Whatever your choice, subscribe to this channel and keep up with everything new about this topic. Now, let's look at one of the most exciting prospects for AI-driven cars. Geely is a prominent Chinese automaker with brands such as Volvo Cars, Lotus, and London Electric Vehicle Company. And it has recently marked a significant milestone in the automotive industry with its innovative autonomous driving technologies. Earlier this year, Geely announced the successful implementation of the world's first autonomous drifting. As we already learned, this is not true. Stanford and Toyota have done it before. What is special about Geely's video, though, is that the test vehicle drifting on ice is completely unmanned. 
Not even a test driver is on board who could intervene in an emergency. So what goes into Geely? The core of Geely's latest advancement incorporates large AI models with digital and intelligent driving systems. This technology enables the vehicle to perform complex maneuvers such as autonomous drifting on icy roads. According to the company, this is a task that requires precise control that only a professional race car driver could achieve. This is possible through a perception-large model algorithm that can sense and predict in real time just like an actual professional driver. Moreover, the steer-by-wire system of the car facilitates exact manipulation of the drift direction, allowing adjustments to be executed within milliseconds. Geely's test vehicle showcased these capabilities on a snowy test track. It was equipped with millisecond-level wire-controlled steering and wheel-side motors with fine-torque vector control. This setup allows for precise handling and real-time power distribution essential for maintaining control while drifting. Greeley's development is not a simple technical exercise, though. Greeley plans to integrate this technology into mainstream products soon, with expectations to feature it in models like the Geely Galaxy and Lynx & Co. This move is going to change a lot of things in the car industry for sure. So why incorporate this technology in cars in the first place? One of the primary reasons automakers are interested in integrating advanced AI stunts, like drifting, into their vehicles is to improve AI's decision-making abilities in critical situations. By programming vehicles to handle extreme driving maneuvers autonomously, engineers can significantly enhance the AI's ability to make split-second decisions. These capabilities are crucial in scenarios where human drivers might hesitate or make errors, such as slippery roads or sudden obstacles. For instance, if a vehicle can autonomously drift around a sudden obstacle and an icy road while maintaining control, it can prevent accidents more effectively than traditional driving methods. The AI learns to predict and react to dynamic environments. Then, it can adjust the vehicle's trajectory, speed, and steering in ways that are simply too challenging for normal human drivers under stress or panic. Moreover, as AI continues to evolve through these tests, the eventual integration into everyday driving scenarios means vehicles could become safer for basically everyone on the road. The precision of AI in executing complex maneuvers could lead to fewer road accidents and better traffic management in adverse conditions. But there's a lot to criticize about this too, the biggest being safety concerns, which is, interestingly, the very argument that companies use to make a case for AI in the first place. What if the AI's decisions backfire and cause accidents that would never have happened with normal vehicles? Concerns primarily revolve around the ability of AI to handle unpredictable scenarios that a human driver might navigate with intuition and experience. There's also the question of how AI-driven cars will communicate and make decisions in split-second situations, particularly when human lives are at stake. The ethical implications are equally important. Who is responsible when an AI-driven car is involved in an accident? How do we program ethical decision-making into machines, especially in scenarios where harm is unavoidable? These questions show the need for robust legal frameworks and ethical guidelines as AI becomes more prevalent in our vehicles. Reliability remains a critical concern. Despite advances, the technology is not foolproof. Issues like sensor malfunction, software errors, or unexpected failures can lead to dangerous situations. This uncertainty contributes to public skepticism and calls for rigorous testing and standards before widespread adoption. The future of AI in driving opens up fascinating possibilities, but also poses significant questions. One of the most pressing questions is whether AI will completely replace human drivers. Will there still be a place for human drivers? And if so, what will that role entail? As we navigate between full automation and manual control, finding the right balance will be crucial for ensuring that technology serves us without stripping away our autonomy. This technology is no doubt exciting, but as we look towards a future increasingly dominated by AI, it's very important to address these criticisms and questions thoughtfully. Would you let AI take over the wheel? Share your thoughts on these new technologies in the comments. And if you want to learn more about current advancements in autonomous vehicles, check out our video on self-driving shuttles. Thanks for tuning in.